sounds good. Okay. So are you ready to begin? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, let's start today's practice with a warm-up. Now, you said that you are a salesman. What do you sell? Uh, uh, do you know battery? Battery, uh, energy storage system. Battery. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, energy storage system. Uh, it's used uh, uh, in utility uh, in, uh, for power, uh, for greater, greater power. For grid, for greater, greater connect connection. Oh, for grid, Something like that. power for grid connection. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I see. Yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. All right. Thank you very much. Okay. Now, because this is your, because this is your product, I would like you to be, um, I would like you to enhance your pronunciation so that you can say it clearly. All right. Especially that, that it is your product. Okay, so battery for grid connection. Okay, so you're into sales, but I wonder, do you also like shopping? Uh, I like shopping. <laughs> you do? I like shopping. <laughs> you do, okay. Then tell me, why do you like shopping? Uh, uh, because uh, in this process, uh, it makes me happy. Uh, new product. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay, what give, give it what? a try. It makes me happy. And you mentioned about new products. Uh, yeah, new new product. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 new clothes, new shoes. Mm -hmm. uh, ah. It makes uh, makes me confident. I see. I see. Or you can say. Um, okay, I like, you say, I like having, okay, new, not products anymore, I have new things, okay, for myself. I like to have, I like having new things for myself. Is that what you're trying to say? Uh, yeah, yeah, yes. it's, uh, it's I, what I'm, I'm trying to say. All right, and I heard you say that you like to buy new clothes. And I'm glad to hear that because that's exactly our lesson today. Our lesson is about buying clothes. All right. Now, for this afternoon, uh, instead of using buy, let's use the word purchase. Okay. Let's use the word purchase. Purchase. Yes. It also means buy. And instead of clothes, we can use the word garment. Garment. Right, garment. garment. So yes, so garment. that so that you can um, so that you can make your vocabulary uh, more of a variety, not just one word, okay, but many kinds of words. Okay, so okay, take a look at this picture here, and please tell me what's this place. Uh, I select B. It is a shopping mall. Yes. Very good. It is a shopping mall. Now, where do you usually go shopping? Uh, mm, I I usually shopping online. Uh, online. Uh, go to shopping shopping mall is not very usual. Usually, not very usual. Uh, I see. I see. So mm. please explain why do you usually go shopping online and not offline? Uh, uh, online shopping is uh, convenient, mm -hmm. uh, fast, and fast. Uh, directly. Okay. Uh, I I can I can I can buy anything. I can buy whatever whatever uh, whatever I need mm -hmm. uh, directly. Okay, I uh, see. Save 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 my time. Save your time. You're right. It's convenient. It's fast, and therefore it saves your time. And so. Um, how so? How often do you hang out at the shopping mall? Uh, 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 um, one, one or two times a month. One or two times a month. I see. One or two times a month. All right. Well, not too bad. Do you like hanging out there? Uh, not very much. <laughs> not very uh, much. I uh, see. Okay. Shopping. Uh, I think shopping mall is uh, uh, is especially for women. 
for women. Women like to <laughs> find out that find out like uh, yeah. Yes, that is true. That is true. Okay. All right then. So now let's. Well, I on the which I on the other hand, I like to go shopping at the mall. I prefer to go to to the store because I want to touch the clothes. I want to you know see it, and more importantly, I'd like to try on the clothes first. The uh, try on the garments first before I purchase. Okay. Please yeah. read this sentence. Would like to try on this pair of shoes? Sure, I will try them on. Okay, very good, excellent. Now, so try on means to put on the clothes and see if you like it. And of course, to try them on, we should go to the fitting room. Okay, fitting room here. Okay, and please read the two sentences. Where's the fitting room? I want to try the uh, try on this dress. Okay. All right. So, what about you? What clothes do you like? What garments do you like to try on? Mm. Uh, <laughs> uh, how to say? Can can I? Yes. And I want mm. you to use the words "try on" in your sentence. Uh, I like uh, I like uh, try I like to try on. Uh, I don't know how to how to uh, describe okay. this yeah, kind but... this kind of clothes. Okay, you can go ahead uh, and it, yeah, you can go ahead and type uh, it. it. Type it in Chinese. Wait a minute. Oh, uh, Western style clothes. Oh, Western style in, clothes. Okay. Western. Uh, in, uh, mm -hmm. Continue. In. Uh, 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 I, I need this kind of clothes, clothes in a uh, normal situation. Uh, because I need this kind of clothes. Okay. For instead of saying normal, maybe uh for daily situations. Okay, daily situations. Daily situation. Yes. Okay, okay. All right, very good. So Western style clothes. All right. Okay. Now let's continue. Now this is why this is why we need to try on the clothes. Because clothes it can be loose. Okay. It means it's loose. very big. Okay, please read the okay. sentence. This pair of jeans is too loose for her. Mm -hmm. Okay, it's too loose for her, right? Sometimes, you know, if you don't if you don't try on the clothes, it may be too loose, or it can be too tight. Okay, and did this? Yeah, did this ever happen to you when you uh, purchase garments online? Uh. <laughs> I don't I don't uh, buy clothes online usually. Uh, ah, usually. Okay. I, I buy clothes uh, clothes and uh, clothes and uh, shoes uh, in shopping mall. At the shopping mall. But have you ever experienced this purchasing online? Uh, uh, uh purchase 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 uh, uh, something else uh, uh, not uh, except uh, clothes and shoes. Clothes. I see. Uh, Okay. Now, for example, if this would happen to you, what are you going to do? Uh, I, I I will change the change the size. You will change the size. So, how will you do it if you this happens to you online? Uh, uh, exchange or refund? Okay. Very good. Okay. Now, say that in a sentence. Uh, I will uh, if if I uh, meet this situation, uh, um, uh, I will I will exchange exchange the uh, size or uh, ask for refund. Okay, the size or 
ask for a refund okay very good okay good job okay i will exchange now um i'd like to um explain to you of the word exchange uh let me write here you have i'm glad you use the word exchange and change okay so when we say exchange it means to replace with a different kind okay so for example you are buying a shirt and you don't like the shirt instead you want trousers so that's an exchange okay oh. all right <laughs> but when you say change it is to replace with uh replace the same, same kind thing. yes the same kind maybe but a different size like if this is small you want a bigger one all right so that is change okay oh. okay all right okay, okay. very good very good all right so you are a salesman indeed because you know the words ask for a refund okay or ask for a refund very good yeah you can do that so if if the clothes is too big you can you can exchange you can change refund or return return the merchandise return. right or here's another one you can also take in okay it means to make the loose clothes to become tight okay take in okay please read this sentence did you take in the dress yes i it was too loose for for me so i took it in okay very good too loose i took it in what about you um uh, do you okay do you wear loose garments or Height or fit garments. This is fit. Uh, I don't uh, catch you very much. Uh, yes. Um, what do you say? Yes. What What garments do you prefer to wear? Something loose or something fit? Uh, fit. You uh, like? Uh -huh. I uh, I prefer something fit. All right. Okay. Talk more. Come on. Speak more uh if uh, if if we lose uh we are some something loose or too loose or too tight mm -hmm. it it seem very very uh, uh what can i say it's a, a teenager teenager they they wear <laughs> okay they wear this style okay. this this style uh, mm -hmm. this style of kind but uh, for our adult mm -hmm. uh, uh we we wear uh fit clothes mm -hmm. uh it uh, it is same uh, uh seem norm normally normally okay okay all right so you said like if you wear loose clothes it will be like teenagers or you can say it looks too um immature okay immature, immature or immature or juvenile okay juvenile you are too young that Ju is Ju too young juvenile. all right Okay, very good. But juvenile ju ju is a, is a, <laughs> a new a new, new word, word for, for you. Okay, okay. So so we have here mature. Uh, mature is for someone mature. older. Someone younger is mm, juvenile, okay. or you could say immature. All right, immature. Oh, immature. Okay, so you like something that is fit because you are no longer a teenager. You can also say it is mm. age appropriate age appropriate yes okay all right age appropriate. Uh, uh, age appropriate or you can say it is appropriate for my age to wear fit clothes appropriate for my yeah. age yes okay all right very good now i'm going to show you some clothes here okay um some garments let me show you all right okay i will teach you another word the new word is outfit okay outfit okay so let me explain this is clothes this is another clothes and this is clothes too okay so if we wear them together we call them as an outfit oh, outfit okay outfit. say say are the clothes that one wears at the same time okay, that is an outfit all right understand outfit yes an outfit understand understand 
So what about you? We have here four outfits. Which outfits do you like? Four style. Uh, number I one. Like, uh, uh, number three. <laughs> oh, number three. Okay, you like number three. And tell me why you like number three. Uh, it's uh, look uh, appropriate for adults. Uh, very good. It looks appropriate for an adult. Yes. Good job. Good job. Okay. All right. Okay. Because it because he's wearing suit. Yeah. Someone who is working. Yeah. Okay. Would you wear this at yeah. the office? Uh. Yes. Yes. I see. Okay. All right. I think it's it's comfortable to wear at the office. Okay. Not too formal. It's a smart casual. Okay, now let's continue. Here is the next word. Oh, a beautiful word. On sale. On sale. Okay. On sale. Yes, it, on it sale. It is discount. Yes, very good. On sale means it is a discount. Okay, please read a sentence. All the clothes in this area are on sale today. Very good. Are on sale today. So I guess. All right, you must be very happy if it is if it is one one singles day. Mm. Eleven. Yeah. Eleven. No. Yeah. One on one singles day sale. For example, um, it is the uh, singles day sale, and you found this outfit, but it's not on sale. Are you going to buy it or not? Mm. If I really need it, I will buy it. Uh -huh. buy it. If you really uh -huh. need it, you'll buy it. Okay. <laughs> and I see. Okay. So it depends on the situation. All right. Yeah. Now, let's continue. We have the last word. Say out of stock. Okay. Out of stock. Please read this last sentence. Okay. When the, when the COVID-19 outbreak started, most of the foods were out of stock. Okay, most of the foods were out of stock. Very good. So if you look at here, so there's no more product to purchase. Everything is gone. It's out of stock. Or you can also say it's sold out. Sold out. Sold out. Okay, all right. Very good, very good. Okay, so these are the four words about shopping. Let's use them now in a reading practice. Okay, it says here, um, Mark is shopping for clothes in a clothing store. Okay, so let's listen and then we read together, okay? These clothes are on sale now. Maybe I'll buy a new shirt. What size are you? Extra large, but I should try it on. Where's the fitting room? It looks a little loose for you, but size L is out of stock right now. Then I'll take it in. Okay. All right. So I want you to read. I want you to read Emma and I will read Mark. Ready? Okay. Ready? Oh, okay. Uh, these clothes are on sale now. Maybe I'll buy a new shirt. What size are you? XL, but I should try it on. Where's the fitting room? It looks a little loose for you, but a size L, a large is out of stock right now. Then I'll take it in. Okay, very good. Let's do the reverse. Okay, I will be Emma. Uh, okay. Why, 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 uh, why you uh, uh, pronounce, pronounce uh, XL? It's extra extra large. Why? What's that? Oh, why I said XL. Yeah, you can either say XL or extra large. It's it's okay. Oh, okay. It's all the same. Same, yeah. same. Okay, yeah, okay, okay. Okay. These okay, clothes. These yeah. clothes are on sale now. Maybe I will buy a new shirt. What size are you? Uh, extra large, but mm -hmm. I should try it on. Where's the fitting room? 
It looks a little loose for you, but size L is out of stock right now. Then I will take it in. Very good, very good. Okay, so when we are purchasing garments, the most important question is, what size are you or what's your size? Okay, so we have, okay, will you please read this size? I want to hear your pronunciation. Medium. Medium, okay, exactly. All right, so how about you? Um, when you purchase clothes, you said that you like something that is fit. So what size are you when you go shopping? Uh, me medium, medium. Medium, I see, I see. Okay, okay. All right, very good. So, but when I, when I was um uh, when I was a student, you know, I also like fit clothes, just like this. It's fit. Okay, I like fit clothes. But when I was an, in the university, I was always I always purchased the small size, and sometimes I even buy the XS. But now <laughs> I have it has to be L or XL to fit into a to get into a fit. <laughs> clothes okay you got you got a uh, fat yeah fat <laughs> yeah <laughs> yes exactly <laughs> all right so we are finished with our first lesson today let's review the words about shopping we have on sale try on fitting room lose out of stock take in and also the question uh what size are you all right okay so so that's about our lesson okay the topic is shopping do you have any questions about the topic jim mm, no 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 not a, not a, no questions no question okay you know i'm very happy because in today's class you showed that you do have the knowledge in English. You have good reading, listening, and you can express yourself. And your pronunciation is also clear. I can understand what you are saying. So that means one thing, you have the potential to be a very good English speaker. So all you need to do now is to continue to practice, continue to use your knowledge, so that your speaking skills will grow. I hope you will come back to practice again. Okay? Thank you. <laughs> I, 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 have, I know what you mean. Oh, okay, all right. Very I good. will do my best. <laughs> yes, okay. So remember, the key to improve is to speak a lot. So I hope I can see you again for another class. And uh, okay, that is okay, all. Okay, that is all for today. Thank you very much. And see you next time. Have a good afternoon. Goodbye. See you next time. See you Thank next you. time. Thank you, Oscar. You're welcome. Thank you.